Welcome back. Say hello to PBR Hall of Fame bull rider and co-captain of the, of the new Missouri Thunder, Luke Snyder. Good to see you again, Luke. It's well, been a while. Me. It has. Yeah. You, you're a busy man lately, haven't you been? I, I have been. I mean, we're here to talk about the Thunder, and I couldn't be more excited. This is a franchise just like a, you'd buy an NFL team. So we're going to go head-to-head -head with a bunch of other teams around the country, and, you know, Johnny Morris does everything big, and, and we're happy to be a part of this. I got a great captain with me, my best buddy forever, and, and a general manager, and Randy Bernard, so yeah. okay. ready to rock and roll. Yeah. I think we've got a couple of photos. Um, so your co-captain is? My co-captain is Ross Coleman right, right here. here. And here we, we traveled go. together for 11 or 12 years, best of buds. So, uh, you know, as a, we're gonna have a seven-man roster, so what better to have two heads are better than one, right? When you're chasing seven wild young bull riders and trying yeah. to get them to do good, so. <laughs> <laughs> That's a whole different kind of corral. That's right, yeah. yeah. So seven to a team, do you have your team yet? No, we'll draft the team uh, at the end of May. Okay. Uh, after the finals. So PBR is going to run their current regular season up until May, and then we're going to take over in the new teams format. This is the second most exciting thing since the PBR was founded. It'll run from June to November. Uh, that is amazing. Uh, it is. And it all happens yep. for us down there, in, down there in Ridgedale, right next to Big Cedar. That's right. The Nature Amphitheater, we're mm -hmm. calling the Arena Thunder Ridge. Hence mm -hmm. the name Thunder. So uh, it's it's going to be awesome. We're going to build a festival around this event in our home market. So it's going to be like NFL game day. You're going to have activities where fans can get close with riders, um, other celebrities, and just really do it upright. So we're so happy to put, you know, Thunder on the map for the Ozarks and Missouri in general. It gives uh, everybody in Missouri something to root for. Now, I don't, I don't know if you said it or, or not already. The league, how many teams is this going to com be comprised of? So there's 10 teams. Okay. There's 10 teams. We'll go to 10 regular season events. Each day is a three-day event, so it's almost like 36 games, head-to-head -head mm. matchup in, like, bracket format. And then we'll do our finals in Las Vegas. <laughs> this sounds like a big deal. It, it really is. I mean, this is just outstanding. You know, uh, the PBR broke away, as you know, with 20 guys scrounging up a thousand bucks, and they made what the league is now. So uh, now with this Thunder thing, and we're on groundbreaking level, and the sky's the limit. Yeah. That is truly amazing. I'm looking really forward to the thought of a, a, a few days long festival with music and that's right. all of the events and everything. Oh my goodness, that's going to be fun. All right, let's talk a minute about the team's general manager. I think we have a photo of him, Randy Bernard, there with Johnny Morris. You know what Randy Bernard does in his spare time? <laughs> Tom, do you know? I know. He manages some musician guy named Garth Brooks. Oh, that Randy Bernard. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you know, Randy and I and Ross go way back. Randy and Johnny are obviously really tight and close friends, but uh, Randy is actually a founding member of the PBR as well. He served as the IndyCar uh, president, and now currently he's touring with Garth running that show. So he knows what he's doing. So in other words, this is going to be a top flight kind of thing right out of the box, right out of the chute, really. That's right. We don't mess around. When we decided we were going to do this, Johnny wanted to round up the Dream Team, and that's what we did. So, you know, we have two coaches. We have Randy here as our GM. His leadership is next to nothing. And then Johnny is our owner. I mean, what a visionary he is. So this is going to be awesome. It is going to be awesome for sure. So you mentioned it's almost like an NFL franchise here or something. So are you having some riders from around the country calling you up and going, Luke, really want to come to the Ozarks and be a part of this Bass Pro team? I mean, I, I, who wouldn't want to come here? Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. I mean, we went to New York City last weekend for the uh, the big PBR event up there, and we announced this, uh, made the front page of the Wall Street Journal. Not with bad. This. Um, it was crazy. Mm. So um, kids were just, the young guys, I call them kids now, they were gravitating to us, wanting to know more about this. So it's going to be great. It really is. And the other thing is for people who come to, seeing it on television, it's an exciting sport. Seeing it in person takes it to a whole different level, does it not? Oh, absolutely. Uh, you know, we're going to be on CBS Sports and, mm -hmm. and CBS Network, but any chance you can make a live event, my gosh, it's like NASCAR. Everything's louder and brighter and bulls get bigger. 
Yeah. Uh, we tend to get smaller. Yeah. <laughs> Those bulls are something else, man. Yeah. I'll tell you, you but, guys are brave. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so where do we go to look up, like, a schedule and when you announce the team and all of that? Where do we find all that info? So you'll see stuff coming out of uh, BassPro.com, Cabela's.com, but right now, check out PBR.com. They're okay. continually put it out, and we have a new in Instagram handle, Missouri Thunder, and gotcha. you guys can find us on there. So uh, we're going to start cranking out a lot of stuff. So it's all, all right. developing, but it'll be out there really soon. Oh, I'm well, excited. Luke, thanks for being here today. Good to see you again. Thanks for having me, guys. Good to see you. All right, time now.